probably like a a. May, obviously, if like the United States did it, I would live there. Not in Saudi Arabia because you know their government is so like controlled. But that's the thing. Their government is already so controlled. Number the second of all, our, the United States government is already so so controlled. So like, why not? You don't have to have like you don't have to have a car. N- no no car. Everything you need is right within like limits of needing whatever you need. You know. So why why not? Honestly, and and the rate that we're going with cars, gas, all this shit, that we're not going to have a planet to live on anyways. I mean, being so compact, I think, would be absolutely terrifying. But here's the thing. When I was flying into... Me too, Avery. I'd be so down too. Kennedy, I feel like our lives are actually... Are, are like so much more controlled than we actually know that they're controlled you know that we we just don't see it i don't know i feel like i i guess like people probably would be scared of it because of all the movies where you've seen this kind of stuff but obviously there would still be police in the communities like they would still be honestly it would probably be easier because took police communities like that I feel like there would be such a less rate of crime um fucking so much easier to off the creeps leave them on the outside fucking don't let the creeps in leave them on the outside let them fend for their damn selves I don't know I feel like it would be I I know it's more our the way that of life now is so much more controlled than we actually realize um like even a getting a car like you you realize that someone can look up your license plate and and literally find out so much more like when you get a car you have to have the car registered you have to pay fucking taxes on it you have to do like tags that's basically like a car tax right you have to get insurance on it just for a car alone you're paying for like a fucking house right so you get rid of that Okay, you get rid of the car and told you don't need a car anymore. You don't need it, so you get rid of that. Okay, now you have you you have no really no needs to travel because anywhere you could go, you could walk. Um, I don't know. I feel like it's kind of smart. I feel like it's a smart idea. Oh yeah, credit. Credit is absolutely insane. I feel like, see, the only thing bad I feel like is obviously, like, the communities and stuff that you would live in, I I feel like it would be based on financial situations, which if something were to happen like that, I feel like it should be equal for everybody, like, everybody, which I know that, that, that I, I don't think the United States would ever do anything like that because our world is so... Um, so controlled with power, money, you know, and I don't feel like there's obviously communities when you start like splitting up communities like that, there would be a lot of like diversity and problems with how the government would, you know, treat lower class people. Um, so... I feel like, I don't know, but I think it would, I don't know. Five K to 99, we're five galaxies away. I don't, I don't have any credit cards. I, I wish I knew how to build my credit and nobody ever Nobody ever taught taught me anything about credit. Like, I didn't think a credit score was really that big of a deal until I learned. <laughs> I learned the hard way. Um, so, yeah. 
I don't know. I just felt like that was such an interesting topic. And I wanted to know your, your guys' opinion on it. Really, Melody? I don't even... I don't even... Like, seriously, I have no idea. <gasps> Thank you so much, Leslie, for the love you. You can't get an apartment without a credit card? Or without... Oh, no, no, no. Without credit. Sorry, I'm blind. You guys know that. Kennedy, and there's... You know, there's other, like, um, I've seen other, what would you call it, architects, Arch I kept hearing that shit and it kept scaring me, architect, uh, or, I kept seeing other, like, um, buildings. yeah, buildings, like, that they were, like, planning on, like, there's, like, an octagon, you can actually do research because they're, like, See, and, and this is, I don't know. I feel like obviously for the, I don't know. I don't think the United States would ever do anything like that. First of all, there would be so many people against it. Um, I realize that. But if I could be in the rich one, you best believe I'm, I'm, I'm paying my, I'm going to be in there. But see, the thing is, is something bad always like, you know, something bad always happens to the rich. No matter, like, in all the movies that you see, like, the rich always... I wouldn't say, like, I would I would like to be in the middle class. Middle class. I feel like that's what I... Actually, I feel like I am in the lower class with, like, middle class, pr like, privilege. I, de I definitely don't have rich pr privilege. I have famous privilege because I'm on a TV show. Famous. But I don't have rich people privilege, especially where I live. Like, the state that I, or, like, the town that I live in is, like, old money. Like, regardless, if you have new money, even if you're, like, a new incomer with money, you still don't mean shit in the town that I'm from. So, regardless, if I did have a whole bunch of money and I live in my town, I, I still wouldn't have, I still mean nothing. Because if it's not old, it doesn't mean anything. If your family doesn't have a whole bunch of money, if you're not lines and lines of generations of rich, you don't mean anything in my town. So, I feel like that's... Um, so, I have a house in Kentucky, and um, I feel like... I, I mean, it's, it's not hard at all to get anything in Kentucky. Like, you can... I didn't have to have... I mean, I went and looked at my house, and the same day I was... I, I could have moved in the same day. I pretty much did. Like. I missed you guys too. I missed you guys so much. I'm sorry I've been off for a little while. We are going for the rankings this week. So we're about 4.5k away. I probably will take a break. And then get on at like 8 or 9. But I mean I'm not really like. Too exhausted right now. So we can. Um, I rent my house right now. But. I have been, like, offered to, like, rent to own. I just don't think that I want to live in Kentucky my whole life, which the only thing is, is, like, I do realize how easy it is to, like, it, it would be super easy for me to, like, keep saving and buy a house in, like, where I live, and I could do it very easily um, and get a very nice house where I'm from, um, like, a like a nicer house than I would be able to get a lot of places because of the way that you know things are around where I live but I feel like experiences and you know like obviously I want to give Layla a better life than I had I don't want her to go to school around anyone I know or like the people that I I grew up with basically their kids I don't want her to have to like do like I don't want her to have to go to school with the people that I know for my town's kids <laughs> I just w regardless of how like that it kind of sounds shitty coming out of my mouth saying that but the way that I was I, I mean I don't know I wouldn't say that I was like necessarily treated like terribly but I definitely did not have the greatest experiences in school in general so and plus, people know who I am. People know who Layla is, you know? And Jackie, thank you so much for the roses. 
Um, Joanne, I don't know. I don't want to live up here either. Like, Virginia, I mean, it's there's nothing, like, wrong with it. It's just, number one, the world is, like, such a scary place as it is. And I don't know. I just, I don't necessarily, like, feel safe where I'm at because, obviously, crazy things happen anywhere. But I just feel, like, comfortable, I guess, because it's what I'm used to. That's where I've been my whole life. I have not really, I mean, Tierra has lived here for a couple of years and, you know, she's doing just fine, but I guess I'd have to break that layer of like com comfortability, comfortability, is that a word? I don't know. Y'all know my brain at, at five o'clock in the morning doesn't work that well. Um... I feel like maybe Nashville. I feel like I've thought about Nashville a couple of times. I mean, obviously it would be a little bit more expensive, but, um, and I, I don't know, Nashville's, I mean, it's close to me. It's only an hour. It would be only an hour away from home. And I don't know. I feel like it's, I don't know though. Fifty K in medical debt. Holy shit balls. Well, I'm a couple grand in debt from school that I have to pay off and a couple well, by the end will I start paying on it next year. So that's gonna be amazing for me. Love that. Joanne, yeah, I know. I'm just I don't know, I would love to move soon. I want to get out of Kentucky so bad. Not even Kentucky, just, like, the area that I live. Like, I just want to go somewhere where, where people, like, don't know where I live. And, and when I go to the grocery store, I feel comfortable. Like, it, people don't understand. And the way that people treat, like, I, I mean, 